right, guys. So uh, here we are at InfoZone in Altspace VR. And InfoZone is the very first place you should go ahead and visit as soon as you get into Altspace. Now, what it is, is essentially it's a walkthrough. And you can see actually the follow me over here. And it walks you through, it gives you a very good idea of what Altspace VR has to offer, how you can use it, and it can definitely give you some excellent ideas and get your brain going thinking, you know, in terms of how you can incorporate your business and your life into virtual reality. So let's go ahead and proceed. Okay, so the first thing Altspace is presenting is their social features. Uh, so as I mentioned, Altspace is a social platform and it's all about socializing. It's all about interacting with others. Um, now, one way we use it for our company is we do different types of events. We do, uh, you know, watch parties, meetings. Uh, if we have any kind of strategy sessions we need to do, we'll definitely do it here in Altspace. So, uh, yeah, these are just some of the features that they do discuss. But uh, and we'll go more into detail later. But let's go ahead and go through the rest of this walkthrough. So, obviously, wherever you have, uh, you know, a community gathering together, you need to have some community guidelines, you know, that way people don't abuse, uh, you know, their abilities here. Ultimately, you are in a virtual world, so there's a lot you can do. Uh, so, yeah, Altspace does have some simple but important community guidelines. Uh, respect is paramount. Some of their community standards, um, you know, play nice, just, just the simple stuff. So let's keep going on through here. Now, next thing they discuss is event types. Now, this is the bread and butter for Altspace VR. Uh, this is all the different ways you can incorporate it, all the different ways you can use it. So what I'm actually gonna do is I'm gonna quickly walk you guys through all the different rooms. But what we're actually gonna do is jump into each room and actually explain what this room can be used for, give you guys a quick tour of the place, and you know, possibly give you guys some excellent ideas for you to go out into all space and actually start creating your own content. All right, so first thing, first section of videos is the presentations. So you got your panel, you got your presentation, you got your meetings, and you got your boardroom meetings. Now, as you can tell, each one of these has a different view, has a different uh, use. Here you can have a panel of people presenting be it, you know, your executives presenting to the company, maybe you're hosting a, uh, you know, a panel of specialists, a panel of experts, whatever the case is, you can use it. Uh, presentations, as you can tell, uh, Altspace got a little funny with their uh, wording. They call it alt talks instead of tech talks, but uh, you get the idea. Meeting rooms, very simple boardroom setup that you can incorporate, uh, you know, to any kind of meeting that you need to use. Boardroom meeting, is literally a boardroom <laughs> meeting room uh okay so let's go ahead and continue on to the other sections that we have so the next section is the talk shows now this is if you have a podcast if you want to create a podcast maybe you want to start a late night show maybe you want to have just some discussions uh they have different rooms for you late night set is your typical late night set you want to be the next jay leno of virtual reality that's the room you want to use. Uh, Roundtable discussions is cool if you want to have any kind of a discussion. Maybe you have you want to have a discussion with your worker, you know, your coworkers. Maybe you want to have a discussion about a topic that is, uh, you know, a bit of a spicy topic. This will be an excellent place to have it, and you know, record it and post it online for people to see. VR podcast now, uh, it's not really, uh, so it's not really perfect for podcast per se. Uh, but, you know, you can host podcasts, you can have, there's two podiums, there's a nice backdrop, and there's people that could sit there. So you can essentially have any kind of a show here. Uh, now let's continue on to the next section. So here we got performances. Uh, and yes, believe it or not, this is one of the most popular things here in alt space. So you got your club stage, which is very popular for... You know, mic nights, maybe some stand-up comedians. Uh, there's usually a comedy hour where uh, different people come and showcase their humor. Uh, you got your Vista stage, which I've actually experienced a few talent shows. Uh, yep, there are some talents in there. And, uh, you know, there are also people that aren't talented. But, you know, you get, you get it all. Uh, and then this one, club improv, just your typical improv 
uh, studio. And same thing here, you can host any kind of a performance, any kind of you know speech, anything you want. Let's move on to the next. So here you got the watch parties. This is if you want to hang out with friends, if you want to, as I mentioned, you know, sometimes we have uh, socializing hours with, uh, you know, co-workers. This is the best place to do it. You have a movie theater set up, you have your game stream set up, and you have a dance party set up. So just to give you some ideas, uh, now in the dance party, I've actually been to a couple quote unquote house parties here in virtual reality. And ultimately it's a house where people, you know, there's music playing, people come in there, they socialize. Um, but yeah, that's, that's just a brief movie theater. You know, you got different types of movies being played. You can stream different types of movies and whoever is there can watch it. It's got a nice sound system. So it, you really, you can really lose yourself in these virtual rooms. And then game streams is any kind of game streams. You know, you got your Twitch, you got your mixer, uh, just the different things that you can watch. So let's move on to the next. So here we got the meetup rooms. Now the meetup rooms is more of a, think of it like a center for people to get together. You got your Orion Court, you got your rooftop games, and you got your Office Olympics. All of these are just interactive rooms with different things to do. And you know the whole purpose is that while you're playing these different games or doing these types of interactive things, you're also socializing with the people that are there. Um, so you got some basketball shoot. I mean, you got your basketball court where you can shoot the basketball. Um, you know, same thing with Orion Court. You got. Um, you also have fireworks. There's just different things that you know we can get into once we are in these rooms. Um, let's move on to the next. So here we got gaming. So this is uh, Alt Spaces, two rooms for gaming. So you got your Alt Quiz Party, which is your typical quiz bowl. Uh, you know, in a type of environment where, you know, people get together, questions are being asked, you answer, you get points, and uh, it's, it's pretty fun. Next one is the Holograms Against Reality. If any of you guys are familiar with uh, Cards Against Humanity, uh, this is a uh, version of that for your virtual world. So uh, I believe it's six player games. Uh, so you get in there and you know people interact and they play and uh, yeah, it's a, it's a great socializing atmosphere So that's the breakdown of the different types of rooms that alt space has So now let's go ahead and proceed to the hosting events The last part about alt space and this is my favorite is the ability for anybody who does have alt access to alt space to host their own events so we just went through all those different rooms that uh, you know you can have the different types of events. And with Altspace, you can use any one of those rooms for any type of event that you would like to host. And ultimately what Altspace does here is break down the different ways that uh, you, know, you can set up your events and actually host them and get people to attend and start developing an audience or uh, you know, a following. 